Shakeology was the last thing that I thought I would be drinking every day for 11 years in a row. (laughs) I was literally like, I don't drink food. I eat it. I don't make shakes. I didn't have a blender. Well, I did have a blender, but it was from, it was one that my mom gave me that maybe she got when my, she and my dad got married in the seventies. And so the very first time I made my shake, like it barely even blended the ice, right? There was no creaminess to it. It was gritty. And I may have pressed the blend button for 10 seconds thinking that was enough. Like I knew nothing about making a smoothie, about Shakeology, anything. And I literally thought it was this like scam. It was this gimmick that it was just a way for this company Beachbody to get my money every single month. Like I was so negative. I was so against it. I also was at a period in my life where I, I really thought doing a workout alone would get me the results that I wanted that I was doing fine with my nutrition. I was having smart ones for lunch. I wasn't eating very much at all. Um, I was, you know, keeping all of my beer consumption to the weekend and getting um, keto, but like sometimes at like 1 a.m. and 2 a.m. after drinking all of that beer. But all I needed was that workout. I didn't need a shake and a nutritional plan. Like I was like... And after making my first shake, I was like, that tasted horrible. That was gritty that I blended for only 10 seconds in my 1970s blender. I was ticked. I was like, this is terrible. I'm never drinking this again. And my husband looked at me and he goes, you paid for it. You got to figure this out and drink it. Can't let this go to waste. So I was like, "Uh oh, got caught. Right. So I reached out for help (laughs) and I reached out to my coach and I was like, how do you make your shake? And, and the magical thing she told me was like, you got to blend it for like 40 seconds, (laughs) Erin. So I went to, I went to Walmart and got a new blender for like 14 bucks, blended it for at least 40 seconds. And it was totally different. She also gave me her favorite recipe for making it. And I literally was like, oh my gosh, this tastes like a Wendy's frosty. Okay. I can do this. And so I, and she said to me, you have to drink it every day if you want it to work. So I was like, whatever. And I'm like, oh, and, and I was feeling sh- kind of shameful that I was giving up so easily. My husband was like, you paid for this. You better at least drink this one bag and see how it goes. And so I was like, all right, I'll do this. So with my new Walmart blender, my f- directions on 40 seconds of blending, my husband saying, just drink it. I was like, okay, I'll do this. So I drank Shakeology for 30 days with absolutely no, no intention of drinking it ever again. Okay. In fact, I had already called and canceled everything. I was like, no more beach body. You can't get my money. I mean, my mindset was right. Like they're out to get me. So here I am now, 11 years later, what shifted? So a few things shifted for me. So the first thing was, is that after three weeks of drinking my Shakeology every single day for breakfast on my way to work, instead of a Starbucks mocha and a pumpkin loaf, I noticed that while I was teaching my first period English 12 class, it started at 740 in the morning that I was like standing up there starting class and I felt good. I was like, oh my gosh. And the thought in my head was, I don't feel foggy. I feel, I feel um, energized and awake. And I was like, wow, okay. I feel different. And then I started noticing, I was like, wait, hold on. I haven't had a headache since I started this because I had a headache every day. I took Tylenol every single day for headaches. And I was like, wait a minute, I haven't had any headaches. And then I was like, wow, this is so awesome. And then I noticed this too. Wait a minute. I haven't craved a cookie every day because literally I was this person. I think I've said literally a lot, so I'll stop doing that. But I was this person that every single day after lunch, I I said to myself, I need a cookie. I need a cookie. I need a cookie. And I recognized that. So I really wasn't expecting a single change because I was thinking that this was just a scam and just a gimmick because I knew absolutely nothing about nutrition. And so I just was drinking it because I told David I would. And it tasted like a Wendy's Frosty. So why not, right? So why not do the thing? And then when I started noticing how I was feeling better and differently, it all started adding up. 
And then soon all the bruising that I had, I bruised so easily. I could barely run into something and I would have a really bad bruise. All my bruising was starting to get better. My energy bet was better. My cravings were down. I was feeling alert and energized in the morning. Um, I was just feeling so much better. And so that having my Shakeology every single morning was the catalyst for lots of amazing things to come and created ripple effects of health benefits on the inside. And so that was it. And when I had it for breakfast every morning, it really was a catalyst for the rest of the day because in my brain, I was like, wow, I already did that already invested in my health this morning by having this shake, I'm going to make better decisions as the day goes on. I am going to get my workout in because I already had my shake. And so it just gave me a little bit of, of that motivation, right? To continue doing healthier things throughout my day. But the biggest change for me has happened over time as I have educated myself on nutrition and I have educated myself about Shakeology. And I do think that's your own due diligence as well. And because I am not a nutritionist, I am a raving fan. Okay. But one of the most, the coolest moments ever was getting to meet our co-creator, Darren Olean in person and have lunch with him at Cafe Patachu in Indianapolis. He came to Indianapolis for a local event that we were hosting for coaches in the network. Now we're called Body Partners. And, and he was speaking all about Shakeology. And it, he was like this mythical creature. And, and I still didn't really quite understand like how foods created and, and harvested. And I just was so far, I didn't understand any of that yet. And here he was standing on stage and telling me about his travels around the world, finding the, the ingredients and finding the adaptogens and the herbs and the superfoods. And he was finding them based on where are the healthiest people in the world? Where are the healthiest people that aren't experiencing heart disease and, and aren't experiencing these types of cancers and are, ha are, are living a, a life full of vitality. Where are these people and what are they consuming from their region that we are not consuming? And he grabbed our ingredients, you guys. And he worked with Isabella Deichler, our company's CEO, his wife, who is, oh my gosh, so good at all of this. And he worked with her and they collaborated and they wanted to make something that we wouldn't have to go to GNC or wouldn't have to go to Whole Foods or wouldn't have to get on Amazon and have to order all these separate little powders and these tinctures and these ingredients and make our own superfood smoothie. They said, we want to do it for people and get it in the hands of the modern day consumer who's busy and on the go. And we want to make something for them. And that's what we have in Shakeology. And when I understood the history and I got to talk to Darren and I learned who he is on the inside and what he brings to us and his knowledge. And I know, I knew that he traveled the world to give us ingredients that are forested and harvested in ways that are just, are so well done, are ethically sourced. I felt so proud to drink Shakeology every single day. And so that's one of the things I wanted to share with you today. Not only has it helped me, but I am so proud to drink Shakeology every single day.